Hello, welcome back again everyone to the Daily Dose and a great day to everyone out there watching and today we are going to show you some cars, new cars actually from uh, Hot Wheels. We also got from uh, cars from Mini GT, Tarmac Works and Matchbox but mostly Hot Wheels here. But before we proceed, let us say thank you to MOD, Ministry of Diecast. We got T100 Blog, Children's Toy Closet, Inc. Daily Dose of Diecast, Mini GT64, Nahar Yusuf, Eden Garage, Job Joe73, and Tarmac Works for all these wonderful pictures. So please do follow them on their social media accounts. Yes, yeah, so let us start off first now with some Hot Wheels and apparently leaked 2020 Hot Wheels G case now available. So yeah, it's really funny in our country here. We still don't have the B case for 2020. We, e we even have only a few cars for the 2020 uh, A case and yeah, lucky you out there. You, some of you have the G case available and we'll check out some cars here. Oh, apparently there's a recolor of the Porsche. This is in yellow. Uh, what is this? GTR, right? Bone Shaker. Gold Batmobile is also available for the G case. And what else? What else? What else? Duck and Roll here. Um... This is oh Hudson Hornet. This is a Mazda right here. Another RX7 here. Uh, KNN Dodge D100 also for the G case. Uh, Monkey Honda Gas Monkey also available for the G case. The red Honda City Turbo is also available available for the G case. So. Yeah, this is also the same color, but I don't know if this is the same uh, car. I mean, uh, this car has the same tempo as uh, what is available in the uh, Japan Historic 3, but I think they have the same color, right? This is in red. And then, uh, what else? Land Rover Defender pickup and some Mazdas here regular version so some sneak peek of the uh, Hot Wheels 2020 G case yeah so I'm sure we will uh, talk about the uh, G case cars in our future videos maybe some clearer pictures and more cars but so far these are the cars to be leaked for the G case next up a new uh, series from Hot Wheels this is their overwatch series so yeah, fantasy cars in this set, but what I like uh, is the uh, art card. So, yeah, really, I'm I just really try to appreciate uh, everything Hot Wheels uh, is giving to us, even their fantasy cars. I mean, yeah, if you look at the art car art on the card in this set, in this car, in these cars, I mean. They are really fabulous. So check on, check this one out. This is Soldier 76. Yeah, not really familiar with these cars. So kindly comment down below what uh, they are. Next up here, this is actually a good looking art here. Let's talk about the art because yeah, these are fantasy cars. And the art on the card looks fabulous. D DVA or Diva, is that how you call her? Next. Tracer right here Really anime looking uh, looking characters here for the overwatch series next Reinhardt with this uh, big SUV right here. This one. I really like looks like a, a Gundam robot, right? Yeah, actually really cool and then we have Roadhog So yeah, he looks like Pudge so not really familiar with Overwatch characters or the Overwatch game, but I bet uh, this character has the same uh, attack as Pudge, right? Yeah, kindly comment down below if I'm wrong or if I am right for you guys out there who are familiar with Overwatch. Next up here, this is another 2020 mainline and yeah, 
We've seen seen this one in a GK set. So this is the Hudson Hornet, new Hudson Hornet from Hot Wheels, part of the mainline uh, set for them next year. And this one actually looks premium, except for the tires. Though they this one doesn't have rubber tires, of course, and doesn't have metal base but looking at the body here lots of decos lots of tempos here no uh details though on the uh, on the headlights but yeah this one looks premium love the interior it is red yeah, a lot of uh cars way back in the 60s 70s have red or tan interior yeah check out the uh Tampos here, Hudson Hornet 817. Don't really know what it means. Hot Wheels Rod Squad. So, this is part of the Rod Squad series. Then the Hot Wheels logo below that. Next up, <clears throat> some two packs. Not really seen two packs here from where I live. And some more new two, two packs here. We got a Mustang two pack convertible here, and the other one both have flames and then here's another one wait is this a diora or not i know there's another fantasy casting that looks like this but isn't called a diora so again guys kindly comment below the name of this car here and below uh that car well, what's this chevy <laughs> Again, please help me out. Please also help out our viewers. So for so some of you who know the name of these cars, kindly comment it down below. Next up, yeah, lucky guys from India. We have the Boulevard set now is available. For Thank you to Ministry of Diecast and Job Joe for this picture. So yeah, let's do a quick uh recap of the cars in the set we got the bone shaker this is a matte black with the flames on the side t1 panel bus this is an urban outlaw bus here you can see the tampos our urban outlaw and then nissan skyline gtr r33 in silver oh uh, yeah a lot of 33 still released by hot wheels i don't know exactly when the hype of the 33s or the JDM will die down or slow down but yeah Hot Wheels is still releasing a lot of 33s and JDM cars so hopefully a slight change will be coming as to not over flood the market with JDM cars right now the uh, RWB Porsche is also over flooding the market so hopefully they won't over saturate the market too much then we got what is this Mustang I think this is a Ford Mustang and then Chevy Silverado yeah this one looks amazing probably the uh, best in the series my favorite here Chevy Silverado pickup and next up here this is from Matchbox another uh, part another set here another I mean pair for their uh, convoy series we got the dirt smasher and this uh, trailer here carrying lumber it reminds me of what tamika have and yeah, really good looking here and next we've got some cars from mini gt we got the uh, prototype bmw m4 coupe these are first color prototypes these cars will be released scheduled release will be on 2020 uh, the first quarter of 2020 we got gold and white yeah, pretty plain looking street looking uh, BMW M4 proper looking M4s here and following that up we've got some cars here uh, these are from Tarmac Works so these are the last web web store release for uh, 2020 and it will be out on December 30 at 10 p.m. Hong Kong time. So the first car here is a 164 scale model of the uh, Illust Asia and RWB 993 Sup 
Supreme or oh, Super 9 I mean <laughs> collaboration and yeah this one looks looks pretty pretty awesome and I'm I think I will just wait for a sale uh, before getting this one hopefully there will be a sale because most tarmac works cars here the older release I mean they are having a big sale on uh, a lot of a lot of their cars like more than 50% off some are three for uh, $20 three for 1,000 pesos so that's the biggest they have that's the biggest they sale they have so I, I will just wait for these cars to be on sale and next up we've got some ignition model these are 164 scale cars we've got the Nismo R34 GTR Z tune this is in metallic red this is quite expensive this is now available here for more than uh, fifty dollars so imagine that 164 164 scale cars uh, for more than 50 US dollars and they, they also have this color way here or uh, different variant we've got a silver uh, ignition model Nismo R30, R34 GTR Z tune and then here is a 1 and 18 scale Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 5 so this was the car used uh, back in the 1998 Australian rally and yeah it looks pretty amazing remember this is a 1 18th scale model again of the evolution 5 so I just wish they uh, put a minifigure here inside of the drivers uh, in this car or who used this car back in the uh, Australian rally in 1998 yes so those are the cars in this video I hope you enjoyed this one kindly comment down below your favorite uh, cars in this set or in this news and I hope you enjoyed this video so yeah if you enjoy this one please smash the like button subscribe if you haven't yet Stay tuned for more. Bye-bye. Peace out and enjoy the rest of the day. Bye-bye, guys.